Hey, what's up, everyone? Nintendo the Unicorn here. We're going to be doing, trying out a new series and see how it does. So, um, what is it? This is going to be called Binge Play. What this is is somewhat of a long play with, long, oh, long play with commentary. However, it's also going to be split up in multiple videos. But this is mainly something that affects me. It's like a short Let's Play, but I'm doing it all in one setting. The videos will be uploaded pr as fast as possible. And um, what is it? So yeah. Now I might have to take a break here and there do the phone ba on camera battery, but when I do, it will be as short as possible. As in, I'm gonna get this thing charged up and try to play again, unless like something comes out like my mom gets home or something like that. So yes. Um. So that's what this is. So what are we gonna binge play? I decided to binge play something that's not too long, but also a good length. And that is Kirby Superstar for the Super Nintendo, which I downloaded recently. Now, quick update. Um, I did. I decided to cancel the Mario Party 8 Let's Play. That mode kind of just brought me down. It's not that fun. I'll still have to do it in my own time to unlock that last stage. But um, as for the LP of that, that's it. So yeah. How does happy intro? Actually, let me get the remote. Shit, you just saw me in front of the camera. Oh no, strike. So yeah. Anyways, this is Kirby Superstar. So yes, today we will be doing the first one. Now, as you see, now I have started file by delete both of these. Um, what is it? I made a post on Twitter about safe file deletion, scary stuff. Like before, how can we make a scary alarm sound like they do in Star Allies? Deleting a safe file was welcomed by a death sound, like Kirby losing a life sound. Da 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 da. da like when you do it. Nowadays, in Star Allies, like, when you try to delete your save file, the last page where it's like, are you really sure it makes a, like, oh my god. Like, save files are not supposed to be scary. So, anyways, so, as, um, before we do this, I'm going to quickly explain Kirby Superstar. It's obviously a Kirby game, but it has multiple different adventures for it to do. Spring Breeze, Dino Blade, Great K Offensive, Gordon Race, as well as mini games like Megaton Punch, Samurai Kirby, and of course, those two things off on the side, those are modes we have not unlocked yet, but you can obviously see the name of them. So yes, let's go ahead and get into this. Um, wait, I can figure the controls right. Yes, um, <laughs> all right, wrong button, wrong button. Before we get into this, um, let me go ahead and remind myself of the quick control scheme I have here. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I'm using a different controller now. I switched controllers ever since I configured this, and I forgot about that. So, let me go ahead and quickly configure this real quick. Okay, I finally configured this to my own. The reason I'm configuring this is because the game's normal controls are way too different for me. Compared to Kirby games I've played, like, Plant Robot, Triple Deluxe, or, like, Star Allies, where I'm used to doing stuff. So, A is going to be my jump button, which originally was B. Um, originally... Um, what is it? Originally, Y was the action button where you do the moves and the inhaling. I switched that to B. X is going to be my spawn partners, which that was originally A for some reason. Y does something I don't know, but it does what X does. I don't know what X does for this game, though. No. So, L and R, the usual stuff. ZL is going to be my select button because that's actually how you delete save files. And I kind of switched that real quickly to delete some of the save files so I can get ready for this. Um, ZR is also going to do what R does, and minus is the menu, and plus is the regular plus. Sorry. So, anyways, as I said, yes, I had to delete some save files. I have already played a little bit of this. I played Spring Breeze, Gourmet Race, and Megaton Punch by myself. And I did a test recording for this, and I did Dino Blade. Not exactly a test recording, but more like deleted scenes. It was bad quality. Luckily, this looks like it's going to do well now. So, yes, I've done Dino Blade and all that stuff. So, anyways, let's go ahead and get into this. Spring Breeze. And we're going to start a brand new spanking game. So, yeah. No, this is not my first time playing. Explain copy? No. But guess what? It actually explains this anyways. But, then again, it didn't explain partners in the, um actual tutorial so I guess it's a plus and then 
for me with the X button I can spawn a partner. Uh, there's trouble in Dreamland. King Deity and his soldiers have stolen all the food in Dreamland. Kirby come. Who's our hero? Kirby. Riding in on the spring breeze. Let the adventure begin. Stage one, green greens. So, if you didn't read the thumbnail or title for some reason, that'd be kind of weird. Um, what is it? This um, episode is going to be all of Spring Breeze. It's going to be all of Spring. Ow. But well, screw you two. That's great and dandy. So, I'm going to. Nom nom nom! Gonna eat him and get him Maximato just for how I got hurt that one time there. And I'm gonna keep going on my day. Ow. So, you're probably, probably wondering, why am I doing Kirby Superstar and not Kirby Superstar Ultra? One, I'm doing this because it's not too lengthy, but it's also lengthy. Kirby Superstar Ultra has way too much. Plus, I can't even get Superstar Ultra. Now, I was talking to a friend of mine about this, and what is it? Um, he was like, so why not um, Ultra? Like, why, um, what does um, this have that Ultra does it? Um, what is it? And I was like, 16-bit classic glory. And that's one reason I'm playing this. I feel like Kirby Superstar doesn't get as much attention as Superstar Ultra because Superstar Ultra exists. No! Um, what is it? So yes, and I wanted to show this off because I wanted to give this attention too. I feel like this game needs a little more attention because it's the reason Superstar Ultra exists. Well, one of the reasons. Um, it's not the main reason. But it's one of the main reasons that You know what I mean. If this game didn't exist, Superstar Ultra would not exist either. You wouldn't get Mass DD, you wouldn't get any of that stuff that Superstar Ultra also introduced. So, you can thank this game's existence for that. So, yes. Uh, what well, Superstar Ultra did, it was a remake of, the D uh, of this game for the DS in 2008. It improved some of the gameplay by using the touch tree for certain stuff, as well as obviously quality and like the physics of the game. And I just landed on this beach. Aha! I landed on you! Um, but what is it? What it did also add extra modes beyond what this game already had. And yes, that is like the first boss. He was easy. He didn't even attack me! I was bombing him so much! That's right, kids. You blow up for us. But yes, this game, um, what is it? It didn't have like Revenge of the King or. Um, Meta Nightmare Ultra or Helper Hero. Those are great modes, don't get me wrong. Uh, I wanted to eat him! Wanna do? Stop trying to kill my abilities. I'll say one thing, though, at least in that game, from what I've seen, the helpers are at least more smarter than this. They're not entirely smart from what I've seen. But I can tell you, tell you for experience in this case, the helpers in this game are absolutely retarded. Now, they can help you do damage when you're just a boss, or they're just there to keep you company, I guess. But, oh, I wanted to, I wanted to do an uppercut. Alright, on all of blocks. But, I mean, like, like, in stages of bubbly clouds, like, you'll create a helper, and then, like, in the next, in the span of, like, five seconds, they're already dead. Make that float islands as well. He's already dead. I'm not even gonna help you. I'm not helping you. Try. <laughs> If you're, um, here's what I'm gonna do with my helpers. I was prepared. The first time I played through this mode, as soon as I came into this part, section right here, I immediately was attacked by that burning wheel. He immediately shot a fireball at me, and I had no time to react before I even got hit in the face by a fireball. And I was like, are you kidding me? You. And one thing I kind of found out. One thing I kind of found out. Uh, what is that about this one? Right. One use of the crash ability kills them both in one hit. I'm used to the Kirby games where the crash ability just like does some damage. Like, it does a lot of damage to the boss, and then you just kind of work from there. But in this game, it is the kills. Lolo and La La, and probably Wispy as well. Maybe even Krakow. 
But I'm not gonna do that against Krakow. I have my own method for defeating him. I'm going actually die. I want my fighter back. Okay, that's what I about partners. Partners still can be used to like out. Can keep your ability while getting another one to me, like if you need one. Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna create you. No, don't kill don't kill the mirror guy. I need him. I want him. One thing though, the partners are so retarded that they'll like kill your um uh, kill the enemies that give you abilities before you can even get one. So it's like if you have a partner, hey, uh, no, I'm just gonna, uh, I'm just gonna. Okay, I better say what happened. To, ah! <laughs> one thing, that part of the stage, the worst enemy placement I can ever even see in any game. I guess I recommend using the D-pad because it is a double tap to use because it was originally only with the D-pad. So yeah, so if you need to do a dash out, maybe just for if you want to do dash and dash attack and you're just dead. <laughs> he's like, he's not even gonna get on the star. He just dies. So yeah, I'll say one thing. Helpers on this stage, terrible. Absolutely horrid. And I do want Mike, real quick. No, I didn't want to do that. I'm just going to go ahead and get mirror back because I want it. I'll get you one more time. There we go. Yeah, because I can't you can't like give a mic. So that's one thing. Oh, I got a flower trying to grab me and a bomb guy trying to, well, bomb me. Aren't you just so sweet? <laughs> oh, aren't you just so, oh gosh. Oh no. Actually, I need ability. I lost mirror when I got hit by that. So now, we're about to fight Draco. <laughs> 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 And I usually get the main ability, but I think cut is good right now. I did. I don't even know where he's going. I don't even know where he's going. That works. <laughs> that works. So yeah, and now we're gonna go into the last stage for this mode, Mount DDD. It's time for the main event, guys. Gotta say though, one of my favorite music in the entire Kirby franchise is King Dee's theme. Freaking great. I mean seriously, sometimes I'll just stall sometimes I'll just stall this out just to hear it. But one thing, if you want to finish the battle quickly, boom, 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 boom. If you're doing this alone, just start spamming bombs. He will not get you before you even, um, before, oh, he will not get you before you defeat him. Spam bomb. He'll try. He'll be injured his way forward, but he will not get to you before he is just utterly defeated. Also, I guess I didn't show it off, but if you look on the sides of the ring, you'll find like Mario, Luigi, Peach, Birdo, and Toad in the audience on the side of the ring. So yes. I always liked that, how they just threw that in there as if we weren't going to see that. So yes, guys, that is in the Spring Breeze. Now, for now, this is going to be split into multiple different parts. But I assure you, if all the parts are up, we're not. You, uh, you guys aren't too far from getting the full video. There will be a video of the entire playthrough. So yes, guys. Hope you all like that. Um, what is it? So yeah. And those stars that I looked in the castle and that gave Kirby that inflation thing, 
Those are the same stars we got from the bosses on our way here. Well, one of them from Dee Dee. Next. Next time on Kirby Superstar. Thank <laughs> you.